Hello my friends and welcome back to Vintage Story 1.19.5 Modded. After our last eventful adventure, I have spent some time off screen making sure that I have Windows installed. Um, moved my bed upstairs, which I know is disappointing to you, Clydet. That likes to jump on the bed. Um, I also filled in my fire pit because Claudette seems to be attracted to fire. I don't know why. Strange cat. And Claudette took some burn damage and almost perished. And so I have my uh, fire pit working in here now. I expanded the walls by one block, basically, just to get us a tiny bit more room, square things off. Uh, what else did I do? Ah, I cast a new pick, because my old copper pick is just about kaput, and, um, oh, look at you go, Bamboo Wamboo. Magnificent. And then I used my old pick, which you may see here is nearly shot, um, to begin taking down some more of this cobblestone stuff. Which is why there are little rocks everywhere. Little rocks everywhere. So. I wanted to come over here. And potentially work on taking down the rest of this fella. Potentially. What I'm the reason I'm doing this is because I'm hoping that hiding away underneath, I'm going to find uh, bony soil. But over here where we've got all this fire clay, I don't know if that's going to happen or not. It seems like the fire clay has taken precedence over it. But wanted to get more building materials. Had a wonderful suggestion from one of my viewers, Seraphim, which is a great great name by the way I don't need this severed head anymore <clears throat> while I was out here working on things I had company and they were not friendly so I was forced to relieve them of their cabeza yeah it does not look like I'm gonna see any bony soil from this one but we are getting plenty of building materials. But Seraphim suggested the uh, creation of a balcony. And, uh, and there it went. Okay. Which is fine because we recovered 10 copper from it, which makes me happy. Also, eventually, gonna dig up those path blocks. But I think a balcony would be a great addition. In fact, I was thinking that the balcony could go right up there in between the windows. Right up there. And the other thing that I want to do is I want to put a thatch roof on the building. Um, I thought about doing sod, but considering the amount of materials that would be necessary and stuff, I think I'd, I'd rather I'd rather just do thatch. So I need to stow away some of this stuff. I don't think I have a stack of cobblestone slabs going anywhere. I might. 
maybe oh, let's end the site stairs all right well, let's stow those there and let's get those in there and <clears throat> Need to make sure I have andesite stones because I'm going to create some slabs using the andesite stone and clay. I mean, well, yeah, I've got lots of it. Okay, just wanted to be sure. So we're just going to grab this dozen blue clay and these andesite stones. And I think actually... Is it like that? Hmm. Created by... Oh, okay. All right, all right. Gotcha, gotcha. I got two. Oh, that's the slabs of dirt. Okay. I. Uh, uh, andesite, andesite, blue clay. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Like that. That should be plenty. I'm going to make a few more just because they're useful. Actually needs to go right there. I do want to change the location of this ladder, so that's no big deal. Back out here with shift operational. Right there, there we go. Make a few more of them. That I should be able to just drop down and place the rest of them. Uh, of course, you're going to be that way. Because that's the way it is. What we can do is grab these, drop them in here, and it will set them to specifically place only horizontally which is very handy and that will give us oh come on Don't be a pain in my tuchus. There we go. <clears throat> I'll need to uh, make myself some lovely wooden fences to go around as a railing, I think. I'm almost tempted to bring it out one more, but... Since I don't want to run columns all the way down to the ground, um, I think, you know, we start talking about uh, about physics fails. Alright. We 
we need to get you a trough. But now, I need to cut ridiculous amounts of grass. Positively ludicrous amounts of grass. Thankfully, all the grass I cut previously has grown back as well as new grass on the blocks that we filled in when we dug out the uh, ruins that were right here. But the reason I need the ludicrous amounts of grass is because, like I say, I want to do a thatched roof and thatched roofs are made out of nothing but grass. I had thought about doing a sod roof and the sod roof takes dirt, it takes boards, and it takes grass. And I want the building to look like it's like it's been here a while, you know? I don't want it to... I don't know. I, I feel the thatch is going to give it a little more aged look. up all but like one piece of the grass that I had left um, for other things so I'm still having some struggles with my actions in that last village I mean it's not Not like I have PTSD over it or anything, but I do I do have a a bit of a, a guilt situation going on. Where are you growling at me? Oh there. Oh, you know I killed your mate, huh? And pulled out my bow and he headed for the hills. Or she has the case maybe. And that's the end of my knife, so we'll start with that. And I need to, I actually plan on doing uh, another bit of expansion over this way, but I've got to wait until the bamboo is all mature, which I believe should be one more day for these guys back here at the, at, at the back. Yep, in about a day, and... We'll mature in about four days. So this is actually bamboo spread. We've got bamboo shoots, which is awesome. I, those can actually be harvested and eaten. But look at it go. Man, am I going to have bamboo. I could do a bamboo roof, but I think it would seem out of place. I really do. All right, so... If we come here on the grass, I got 64 and a stack of 19, and I hit H. Uh, hit E, mouse over the grass, and hit H. There we go. It will show us all the things that the grass is part of in terms of creation. And why are we not seeing the thatch roof? Fire pits. Wax lily, huh? Interesting. All right, well, so then I guess we're going to have to go to blocks and items and search for thatch. I'm sure there is thatch roof. There we go. So, um, you can see, it's just so. We can do roof peaks, um, slants, tips, corners, etc., and thatch. So, to make to get thatch back, you know, or I mean, if we end up making too many blocks, we can use a knife and uh, 
the thatch to get back the thatch. Oh, wait. Oh, I misread that. Those hay blocks? Yes. Okay. So we can make it out of hay blocks. And it's going to take more material, but I didn't, you know, they put uh, the Thule uh, into the, the vanilla game and basically made it useful for making thatch, and that's about it. You can't make baskets out of it or anything anymore. So let's um, take all this and turn it into blocks. Oh, yourself. I think eight. Let's go up and see. Okay, actually looks like 11, maybe. But I'm just going to run a ladder up, pop a hole through the roof so I can get up there. Complicated my situation. I was going to do steps going up right there. I was not expecting to have to completely rebuild things, but I had meant to take care of this and just didn't get around to it. And this wall was supposed to go out one farther.
Definitely a short time. All right. I'm going to have to do something about these wolves. They are breeding and their numbers are growing. Wah. Uh, excuse me? What? Okay. Several things need to happen here. First is... Yes, I know things are changing. Change is confusing and can be mildly distressing, but trust me, Claudette, these changes are for the best. Okay? Eventually, you're going to be able to come upstairs and hang out with me upstairs. But first, I need to get some things sorted out. And stupid rock, get out of here, stupid rock. Yeah, I had completely forgotten. Well, you are like every other cat I've ever known. You got to be right in the middle of everything. All right, just to keep it from repeatedly jumping into my inventory, I'm just going to place that rock down on the ground. Come over to the basket and grab two more of them. Because I need to make another knife. Yes, I know. I'm going to have to cut a bunch more grass because I honestly don't think I know any place where there's enough tule to do this easily. And I want to make sure I had a knife so I can clear this foliage and do so in such a way that if a... Uh, Sapling drops. I can get that sapling. Um, just for now. Just so I can get down without breaking my face.
not the project I thought I was going to be working on today, but I had completely forgotten 